Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hi, my name is My Lady, and thank you for joining us on today's video. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back and thank you so much for the love. Please do not forget to like, to comment, and to subscribe to my channel. I hope you dolls are not hearing the sound of the fan because it is extremely hot and there is no way that I can switch it off. So we're just gonna have to manage the video with the sound of the fan but in today's video i'm going to be doing a very light airy summer makeup look it's going to be a sort of a no makeup makeup look i'm just one of those people that cannot have a full face of makeup in the scorching heat so in today's video i'm just going to be doing a light summer makeup everyday kind of makeup look if you're interested please keep on watching and my mirror is this side so we're just gonna have to work with this angle and the first thing that we're going to do is brush out my eyebrows using a fully they are microbladed so it does make everything just easier i have one less step to worry about so i am gonna just brush them up but i feel like the hairs are a bit all over especially on this eye so I am going to be using the soap method. I'm going to take my Maybelline Lasting Fix Spray and a small bar of soap. Brush that around. And then just brush up my eyebrows. So this is what they look like. I'm going to be taking my Essence Primer, it's the pink one. Uh, I'm just going to be putting some on my cheeks, forehead and chin. And then spreading that out with my fingers. And then I'm going to give it a minute or two so that it settles into my skin. My next step is going to be carving out my brows and for that I need some concealer. I need my foundation, a blending brush and I need a flat concealer brush. And I'm going to start at the bottom of my brows with the concealer and the flat brush. And just carve out the bottom And then I'm going to blend that with my blending brush. And then the top of the brow using my foundation.
not the best brow carving that I've ever done but this is what we're working with and then I'm just gonna blend the top next step is using a bit of foundation using my fingers and a beauty blender so i'm just gonna i feel like that's enough there there and there maybe a little bit more and i'm just gonna use my fingers to spread it out on my face the trick with this makeup look is to have as little foundation as possible or to look like you have as little foundation as possible and that is the reason why i am blending it with my fingers because it gives it a more seamless and natural finish so i'm just going to use my fingers for most of the blending and then i'm just gonna finish everything off with the beauty blender my damp beauty blender the next step is concealer under my eye not too much and i'm gonna blend this with my finger as well before i go in with my beauty blender this is how it looks and i don't think there's a need for me to go in with my beauty blender and then i'm gonna go in with a lighter concealer same brand just a bit lighter just a tiny bit of concealer and i'm gonna blend that with my finger as well that is good enough for me and then i'm gonna go in with a dark foundation to contour it looks like i'm gonna be doing most of this makeup look with my fingers so I'm just going to be blending the contour but I am going to use a smaller brush for my nose and I am going to fix this with my beauty blender. And I know it looks kind of bad at the moment but I am going to make sure that I blend it out completely. It looks so much better already. Blend the nose. And I just remembered that I didn't put um, concealer on my nose, the bridge of my nose. Not 
too much. Some loose powder to set. Forehead, nose, and a bit under my contour. And then I'm just going to blend the powder into my skin. Um, bronzer and these are the two that I am using I'm gonna first go in with the matte bronzer from Essence and then go in with the one from not really sure what the brand is oh Palladio it's a discam brand so those are the two bronzers that I'm gonna be using The Essence Bronzer is a bit too light for my skin. That is the reason why I have to pack it on like I am. But I feel like that's about enough. And then I'm going to take the shimmery or the glowy bronzer. And this one, I'm just going to put it on my cheek. I'm feeling like orange blush which I don't have so I'm just going to use this color from my eyeshadow palette as blush I'm not going to put too much okay, I feel like that is enough so I'm just going to blend this out <laughs> And then I'm going to let this air dry. A bit of highlight and this is my trio pack from MAC. And I'm going to be using this shade. Tip of the nose, a bit on the bridge of the nose. So I'm just going to be putting a bit of mascara and then I'm going to go do my lip off camera and then I'll be back to show you the, the final look. So this is the final makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please do not forget to like, to comment and to subscribe.